Call of Duty just couldn't let a week go by without some bad PR, so they announced yesterday that Warzone Caldera, aka the original Warzone that everyone loved and made them billions, probably, but has since been plagued by making their least popular map the only one available, is being shut down. Effective September 21st. They couldn't have given it the dignity of being taken out behind the shed to get a bullet between the eyes. Instead, they had to let it slowly die in the background for nine months, like the worst miscarriage ever. And did you like all those bundles they manipulated you into buying? Well, they're all gone too. I mean, I guess technically you could still play as Jigsaw in 2019's multiplayer if that would even work. And the worst part is that we already have duplicate skins that were in Warzone 1 sold as part of a bundle and now are showing up as new bundles in Warzone 2. So this is only going to lead to them adding more and more. Now, if I'm honest, it shutting down doesn't personally affect me that much because Warzone, in my opinion, got old ages ago. But that doesn't mean that there aren't tons of people out there who loved and still love this game. I mean, just taking away the COD cycle and, and just stepping away from the, the COD perspective fish tank that, that we all kind of get lost in sometimes. The game was only four years old, and its last major content update was only a year ago, to the exact date even. You know what other games were released more than four years ago and still have servers running? Destiny 2, Master Chief Collection, GTA Online released a decade ago for fuck's sake. By the way, RIP to Fortune's Keep, right? And all the devs who made a map that was only even available in game for a few months before Warzone 2 showed up and hit the big old delete button over all their hard work. So yeah, it's a dark day for COD. You know, maybe something good will come out of this, like the new Warzone will end up getting old maps or features, but honestly, it's probably just so Warzone Mobile is a cleaner sales pitch. God, I'm so tired of the best Call of Duty games being on mobile. Who is playing first-person shooters on their phones? Genuinely, I've never met a single person. Someone let me know. Everyone I know who plays mobile plays on a fucking emulator. I'm so con- what? Who are these people? But don't worry, everyone. We can all rest assured. Warzone Caldera may be nearly gone, but at least we'll always have Blackout.